Hey you guys, Lingy here. I haven't been around um, in a couple days. I definitely wanted to say thank you to all my subscribers, all my um, followers on Instagram. I definitely wanted to take a, some time out to definitely say thank you. Today's look is actually inspired by Crispy Makeup. I'll definitely put her link in the description box below. She's like awesome. I follow her on Instagram as well. I definitely wanted to redo this look. It's actually a natural eye with a winged out, with like a kind of a dramatic wing out. A ombre orange lip with a little bit of concealer on the inside. And that's it. So I hope you guys like it. And let's get started. Okay, I started with this e.l.f. beautiful brown palette. It was about $2 at Target. Can't beat it with a baseball bat. I take this mauve color and use it as my base. Then I take this chocolate brown color and use it as my transition color. And then I just blend, blend, blend. Then I take this pearly vanilla color and pack it onto my eyelid. I use the same color and use it as a highlight underneath the arch. I add a little bit more of the chocolate brown in the crease to add a little bit more color. For my eyeliner, as usual, I use the iStudio Eyeliner Gel by Maybelline. Then to set the gel, I use NYX Matte Eyeshadow on top. To add a little bit more depth into the eye, I do a little cut crease slightly. It's not as dramatic, but it's like a slight cut crease. I use the same NYX Matte Eyeshadow for this. I bring the eyeshadow up towards the arch and away from the lid. Then with the same brush, I blend it all out. I still use the Cinema Secret Foundation Palette. I use both my fingers and a brush to clean up underneath for my concealer. I also add it in the center of my nose. For my contouring, I use this shimmer bronzer. It is definitely time for a new one. I put this in the hollows of my cheeks as well on the sides of my nose to create a bridge. With the leftover powder on my brush, I definitely just blend it all out. And for my bronzer, I use Wet n Wild's Mega Glow Bronzer. I put this slightly over my contour powder and blend it into the temples of the cheeks and my forehead. For a highlight, I use this side of the Mega Glow and put it on my cheeks on the top, as well as the center of my nose. For my eyeliner, I use the Maybelline Gel and the powder to set it. And I clean up whatever fallout I have. So I used the Old Diva Goodie, which is the Great Lash Waterproof Mascara by Maybelline, and tried it out. And for my blush, I used NYX's Cinnamon and put it on the apples of my cheeks. And to line my lips, I used Natural by Ramel. Ugh, my hands. And for 
for my lipstick, I used 24 Karat Gold by Wet n Wild. I just did an awesome video um, on these lipsticks. If you want to see it, check it out. And on the inside of my palette, I put my concealer. And just to give the eye a little bit more ooh feeling, I put this Jessie's Girl um, Shimmer Powder right in the tear ducts in the corner of my eye. And I'm just fixing whatever I just covered with the shimmer powder with the gel. And I want to say these are Ardell Lashes 110. Now I love Ardell Lashes, but I am not a fan of the Ardell Adhesive Glue. So I'm going to use the hair glue. <clears throat> So for my lashes, I don't use any tweezers. I feel like my hand is a little bit more precise and I can feel my way through. And this is my finished look. I hope you guys liked it. And comment, rate, and subscribe if you guys do not. Follow me on Instagram, Blogspot, or Twitter. My name is... Make sure you guys thumbs up this video. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys next video. on but definitely let me guys uh, 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 definitely let me uh, uh, definitely let me guys uh, aren't following me on gloss look if you guys aren't if you guys aren't no if you guys aren't following me on Instagram face no the uh, I'll put the link in the description below. Hey guys, Lingy here. Today I wanted to say... Hey you guys, Lingy here.